There are a few folks that might not be too happy with that score late in the game with it already well in hand. You seem a little squeamish about that last I, score. I struggle with it. <laughs> I struggle. But on the other, the, the argument, I get it, on the other side is, hey, do something about it. Stop them. I guarantee you, I know who was really excited. Fantasy owners yeah. who had them. Hey, listen, get the points for me. They're not worried about hurt feelings or anything like that. That's just new age stuff. And now the offense is going to stay out there as the Broncos will go for two. Again, it's locked. And this is going to be caught. So add two more to the lead as they continue to pour it on here in the fourth. Oh, boy, rubbing a little salt in the wound there going for two up this big. You know, there's one time when I played, Brandon, and played against a team that was just absolutely pile-driving us. And they ended up going for two late in the game. And I asked one of the guys, why'd you do that? He said, because we wanted to win by more. That feels like that type of situation. Wow. Well, it could also result in a melee later, though. That'll be taken in the end zone. And no run back here. This will be a touchback, and it comes out to the 25-yard line. The Raider offense set to get this drive started. They've lost this one. Their offense has struggled. Do they try to put together something here at the end just to take in the next week? Yeah, sometimes teams want to do that, and coaches want to. I remember one time I was on a team and we were losing late in a game like this, and you knew it was lost. It was over, right? And the coach called a running play and pretty much said to everyone, I want to see something executed well before we get out of here. And that was the message to the team. Just something to build Just on. Just something to build on, get it done, and maybe we can look at that and say, we'll get better as we go forward. A big offensive explosion help leading them to victory. And the defensive guys, they're just saying, hey, put those points up every week. We'll just keep winning. They will gratefully accept them, won't they? It makes their job that much easier when they're scoring that many points. Allows them to play with a totally different style and a different flow. That'll do it for us, for Charles Davis and all our hardworking crew. I'm Brandon Gordon. You've been watching the NFL on EA Sports. For more, find us on Twitter at EA Madden NFL. The Broncos are winners as we say so long from Denver.